It's nice to finally see you. Your father's been ill. Has he? You didn't tell me that. I thought to myself, she'll come around today and see us, but you didn't. Why is it always up to me to phone you? You can call me as well. Anyway, I'm sure he'll appreciate a visit when you have time. Mum, I went to see a counsellor last week. She said I should talk to you. I think Pauline's daughter is a counsellor. She said that I have a lot of anger towards you that stems from my childhood. Well, I don't know what you were angry about. You had a wonderful childhood. You were always clean, fed. People would comment on how smart you looked. Yeah. I, I was more talking about the emotional side of things, you know, like listening to me, encouraging me, being interested in who I was. What are you talking about? You didn't have a clue who you were. You needed guidance. I did know who I was, you just didn't like it. You wanted me to be something that I wasn't. You wanted me to be like you. Is that so bad to make sure you had manners, good morals, not wasting your time on silly things that wouldn't get you anywhere? I needed you to be my mum. Not tell me I couldn't draw because you didn't want me to do art or that I didn't look right. Like it, it was constant, every day. Like I, I couldn't do anything right. I was trying to help you. Mum, you're not hearing what I'm saying. I don't know what you want me to say. I want you to say, I'm sorry for making you feel like crap about yourself because it's really affected me. Hi, how are you? I'd love that. Okay, I'll see you shortly. I'm sorry, but I've got to dash off. Norma needs me to help with something. So we'll speak later, yeah? Bye, Mum.